Hey guys, Preston here, and we're back with some more Jeff Stripes My Career, and here we're gonna go where we just finished the rookie showcase. Before we get started on this pre-draft interview tour, all right, we got a few things to go over. First, the NBA sent over this personality test for you to fill out so they can get an idea of how you think, what kind of person you are. A test, man? Come on, really? <laughs> all right. All right, man, before that, though, Let's talk about expectations. How you expect your NBA career to unfold? All right, we gotta make sure we always on the same page when it comes to goals and expectations. Okay. All right, let's start with the where. If you had your choice to play for any NBA team, who would it be? <laughs> yeah, that's the one, baby, you know it. <laughs> Yeah, man, I figured you might say that, but you know, as your agent, I can't be assuming stuff. This will help me, though, when I'm behind the scenes working on stuff. Okay, okay, so what is the one thing that's most important to you in your NBA career? Yeah, man, what's up? We done? Yeah, man, we're done. I lined up a few interviews with some teams that were really showing interest in you, all right? All right? But before they talk to you in person, they want to get a feel of what your personality is like, so that's what that personality test is for. All right, so let's take care of that, and then we can head out. Let's do it. All right. Hey, how's it going? I'm the director of player personnel for the Trailblazers. We have the 10th pick in the draft and are interested in your talents. We just want to pick your brain a little before we decide. Let's get to it. This question is a tough one to ask as there really isn't a right or wrong answer. Over the last couple years, we've had entire seasons washed out by insurmountable injuries. As a franchise, we're becoming more conscious on injury histories and what that means for our draft picks. What can you tell us about your injury history and more importantly, your ability to play through pain? I've been pretty healthy my whole life. I've suffered some twists, some sprains, you know, typical kid stuff. The important thing is that I never let it bring me down or hold me back. It's never stopped me from going out and doing what I've wanted to do. Next question. Aside from a few veterans, this is a very young team. We are bringing in a lot of young talent this offseason, and it won't be easy to get this team back into the playoffs immediately. Are you willing to take your lumps as a team in order to grow as a core along with all the other young talent the Blazers have? Yeah, I mean, I would like to think that I have the mental fortitude to help this team grow as a unit. You don't see teams as young as the Blazers get to the top without some growing pains. So I'm prepared for that. Seriously though, I'm just excited to be part of a new era here and I'd love to help bring Portland back to the top of the league. Okay, I think I've heard all I needed to hear for now. You're definitely someone we can use on our team. Now we just need you to be available when it's our turn to pick. Well played out there tonight. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm the scouting director for the Philadelphia 76ers. We're looking for someone with the 11th pick who can help our franchise take the next step. I think you might be that guy. I'd just like to ask you a couple questions to make sure. Here we go. It takes a strong will to play here in Philadelphia. If you give your heart and soul to the team, the fans will support you completely with their adoration. On the other hand, if you ever badmouth them or not give 100% out on the court, they will turn on you in a heartbeat and boo you relentlessly. They truly are the best fans in basketball and expect nothing less than your best. Do you think you have the makeup to play in this city? I definitely think I do, but then again, I've never been put into a situation where my own fans have been against me. I'm just trying to be honest here. I think I can handle it, but can I definitively say I can? No, of course not. Let's see, one more question, if you don't mind. We feel like we have a young team here in Philadelphia with a lot of room for growth. In particular, we have an opportunity at the point guard position for someone to come in and take over. 
Do you feel like that's something you're capable of doing? Yeah, that's an opportunity I'd love to have. I've worked hard to hone my ball handling skills, and I really feel like I could come in and take on a leadership role right away. Being a part of a young team like yours is exactly the kind of situation I'm looking for. That's great. Those answers were music to our ears. With any luck, you'll fall to us in the draft. Man, you ready to talk seriously for a few minutes? Yeah, man, I figured you didn't just come over here to hang out like we used to back in the day. Yeah, not entirely, man. I mean, hey, I'll teach you a little lesson in some NBA 2K later. <laughs> you know, again. <laughs> Whatever, young. Yeah, we definitely gonna have to get a game in, but hey, let's get that business out of the way first, all right? All right, man, look. I know that you've been asked to do a lot to get ready for this draft. Heck yeah. I mean, besides the showcase, you got workouts and camps and interviews. And you handling it all like a champ, man. It's just one last piece we gotta sort out. What? Ah, come on. What is it, another private workout or something? With the Cavs? Nah, 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 Wizards, nah, nah. We, we done with workouts, Rockets, man. It's maybe? nothing like that. Hey, look. We got to get you a suit. <laughs> a suit? Yeah. All right, I can live with that, man. Good, Do it. good, because you know how this draft is, man. I mean, everybody's going to be watching you, so you got to make a splash. Uh, you seen our players in the past went all out. Yeah, man. Noah? Yo, Harden? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yo. Man, no one's forgetting that anytime soon. But hey. I can handle it. You know I look flying whatever I wear, baby. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's up for debate. I got two words for you. Junior prom. What? Yo, I was styling back then, dog. Uh, yeah, right. Styling. <laughs> Come on, son. Oh my Yo, God. I feel you, though. So what's up? What we got to do? Hey, man, look, don't even worry about it. I'm going to front you some cash so you can get something that works. All right. But if you can, you should consider kicking in a little extra just to make sure you really stand out. But that's on you, though. All right, I'm going to think about that. But hey, let's really get down to business. All right. NBA 2K, baby. Oh, come on now. Yeah, I'm going to whoop you, son. Uh, yeah, right. That'll be the first. <laughs> Don't be cheating, either. So this isn't looking too good. I mean, none of the pictures loaded for the suits that we're supposed to buy, but I guess I'll go with this one. I think it's the purple suit, and it's also free. That's the main key. I don't want really want to spend. A, I don't want to spend a lot of money for a suit that I don't think I really wear a lot. So we're gonna go with the free thing. The images aren't loading for the suits, but I think we're just gonna go with it. it says solid suit, so why not? Here we go. NBA draft. Let's see where we get picked. You all right, man? Just relax a little bit. Yo, what if I end up being one of those dudes just sits here forever waiting to get picked, man? Hey, man, look. I've talked to everybody I can. Everybody agrees you're a lock for the first round, all right? It's going to be one of those moments you remember forever, all right? So just relax, man. Enjoy it. Yo, it's just that... Talk to me. It's just... I'm about to find out which team I start my NBA career with, man. I'm about to find out what city I spend the next few years of my life in. It's kind of surreal, you feel me? Hmm. Look, man. It's all a part of the ride, all right? Just relax. Hey, here come the commissioner now, getting ready to get things started. Good evening and welcome to the 2013 NBA Draft. For 60 of the world's most talented and dedicated young players, tonight marks the culmination of years of hard work as their dream of playing in the NBA moves closer to reality. To all of the fans watching around the world and to those here with us tonight, thank you for joining us. And now to the task at hand. With the first pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Cleveland Cavaliers select Anthony Bennett from Toronto, Canada and the University of Nevada, Las Vegas. 
With the second pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Orlando Magic select Victor Oladipo of Indiana University. With the third pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Washington Wizards select Otto Porter from Georgetown University. With the fourth pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Charlotte Bobcats select Cody Zeller from Indiana University. Ah, oh, man, still nothing. I really thought they might have gone with you. Nah, man, they always looked like they were going in a different direction, man. Hey, your time's coming, man. Be patient. With the fifth pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Phoenix Suns select Alex Len from the University of Maryland. With the sixth pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the New Orleans Pelicans. Yes, the New Orleans Pelicans. Select Nerlens Noel from the University of Kentucky. <laughs> With the seventh pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Sacramento Kings select Ben McLemore from the University of Kansas. With the eighth pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Detroit Pistons select Jackson Ellis from UCLA. Nah, seriously, man? I can't believe they picked Jackson over me, man. Hey, man, look, don't you even give it a second thought, all right? He played well in the showcase. You knew he had to go sometime. Hey, but hey, you're going to have the better career when it's all said and done. Man, I better. Otherwise, that dude's never going to let me live this down. <laughs> yeah, man. I feel you on that. All right, listen up. I have a feeling we're getting close. Yeah. With the ninth pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Minnesota Timberwolves select Trey Burke from the University of Michigan. With the 10th pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Portland Trailblazers select C.J. McCollum from Lehigh University. Oh, I thought we were supposed to get picked by the Portland Trailblazers. With the 11th Traders. pick in the 2013 NBA Draft, the Philadelphia 76ers select the 19-year-old point guard from the New yes! Institute of <laughs> There we go. That's what I'm talking about, baby. What I tell you, dog? Woo! First uh, round, boy. Boys, you got the first round, baby. This Where's is your suit? moment. Hey, go get that lid. <laughs> my man. You did it. Yeah. Okay, so the game didn't decide to load my suit or my, sh my feet. But I did get drafted by the Sixers, which is a pretty average team. Or average team, I guess. So we'll see how that goes. And my feet are missing, and I don't have a suit, and I'm wearing some sweatpants and a t-shirt. So that's always nice. I mean, looking nice in my draft day. It's great to have you here. Please, have a seat. Again, let me say how excited we are to have you a part of this organization. We had our eyes on you before the Rookie Showcase, and we were thrilled when you were still available at our pick. <laughs> Thanks. I'm glad to be here. Can't wait to get started. Great. Well, we'll get to that, but uh, we have a contract to sign. I think we're all in agreement. Yeah, good to go. Well, here's the official paperwork for you to sign, and while you do that, I had the media team prepare a little welcome video for you. That's just a small taste of what we have in store for you here. Yo, I'm ready to get to work. Just point me in a direction. Let's do this thing. And I know the coaching staff is just as fired up to start training with you. In fact, they're waiting for you in the film room, so you better head over there now. All right, thanks, man. Looking forward to helping this team get some W's. Absolutely. And once again, welcome to the team. Thanks, man. 
Okay, so we got our contracts set, every set and everything, and let's go to our first game, which we lose. Because, will I even play? I just sat on the bench, and I don't think you guys want to see that too much, so. Let's look at our minutes, and we got zero. We're a prospect, and, well, we're not even playing. That's just great. We're 64 overall. That's pretty much it. Now, here's the next game, which we don't play again, and I think we lose again. Do we lose? Yeah, we lose and I didn't even play. So that's pretty much it for this for, for this episode, guys. So, like the video, subscribe, like, comment, all that kind of stuff. If you want more videos for Jeff Stripes, for my, his my career so far. And that's pretty much it, guys. So my name is Preston. I'll see you guys later in my next video. So see ya.